What's up YouTube? Kev here. Uh, today I'm going to do something a little different. Um, I got the Texan 308 and these 132 grain spitzers. And we're going to see how many uh, 2x12s will penetrate. I believe they're moving around 940 feet per second. Uh, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Uh, actually 2x10s. In there, so it should be plenty enough. I'm, I know it's not going to go through all of them, but I'm thinking at least go through three of them. I believe the Texan 45 went through uh, three of them. Uh, watched the video on it. I believe it was by Twang and Bang. Went through two and cracked the third one, or went through three and cracked the fourth one. One of the two. But anyway, we'll see what it does. about 30 yards away. Okay. <laughs> this gun's pretty loud from my backyard. Okay, so I hit right here, took this thing apart also, uh, and we went clean through the first one, which we all know, and the second one, one in there, exited there, that's two, the third one, one in here, and exited right there, the third one, uh, fourth one, stuck in. You can see the back of the bullet. And let me show you this. There's a knot right there. And also, right on the back of that bullet is a, a knot. So, I think it would have went through this one and stuck in the fifth one. If that knot wasn't there, because you, you can see it, it actually cracked it. But this knot is actually cracked, almost pushed the knot out. It is right behind it. And literally, right behind that knot. I do believe it would have come out of the fourth one and stuck in the fifth one if, if it wasn't for that knot. So, that's all. Uh, clean through three and... Almost through four, that's, that's a lot of power. I mean, that's a lot of wood. They aren't rotten at all. I have no problem going through bone on any game. Alright, well thanks for watching. See ya.